Hello everybody, this is Louisa with Ellie Paper Studio. And today I have a really a few really exciting projects are gonna be divided into different um, videos. Also, my kitty is on the table with me, which if you have if you follow me on Facebook, you would have heard that it's not um, he's not the most he's not the greatest for <laughs> having as a desk mate as he sometimes can step on my things especially the ones that when I'm drawing something with glossy accents and get it stuck on him but anyway um, I have really exciting news I am now part of the uh, Stamp Doctor design team and the Stamp Doctor is an online store they also travel quite a lot and um, with shows, scrapbooking shows on the road, um, please feel free to visit them. I'm going to put their link on the description of this video as well as um, you can find their link on my blog. And please follow them on Facebook also where so you can always know about any special offers. They're a very exciting online company um, and like I said they travel on the road and they um, have some really great products specifically spellbinders and die driven and um, I can show you some of the some of their new dies that are coming for this Christmas this is one of their new uh, die collections it's um, a spellbinders co custom product uh, in conjunction with the Stam doctor and it's a reindeer and a sleigh and you can see this really like the quality is spellbinders quality which we all know it's great so you can do stenciling embossing and die cutting with them um, so like I said definitely give them a try for this particular video I'm actually going to be using uh, some of the products that they carry um, in their store this is uh, part of the spellbinders Shapeabilities uh, Delicate Doilies collection is one of the newer ones. Um, it's a really, really gorgeous, some really, really gorgeous dies, and you can you get six dies, so you get the doily, the outer part of the doily, and then you get three three different ones in really great sizes, and they cut so so incredibly cute. So for this card, and then this embossing folder. This embossing folder is from the new Spellbinders Embossabilities, um, and it's the Twisted Hearts um, folder. And I love Spellbinders. I love their um, embossables. Let me show you one. This is actually a different one, but it's still a Spellbinders one. They're double sided. See, Embossabilities. They're double sided, so you get two different embossing folders with them and then they're most of the time you can you can get some that are smaller but most of the time they're going to be really really large and this one measures five inches by seven and a half that is a great coverage for a you can use it for a five by seven card or larger projects great great coverage with this one you get um this really gorgeous very delicate small and intricate twisted heart and then you get some other you know vine looking hearts um, on the other side and then this cardstock I, I chose a really light pink it's definitely a lighter pink so you can probably use it and it's a little bit more generic it doesn't have any sentiments although you could probably stamp some sentiments you could use it for either a, or a birthday um, a birthday card or even a retirement Mother's Day it's very versatile because of the colors the ivory the light pink um, and just the doilies make it so delicate definitely definitely more of a feminine card and then I will also be embellishing the card with using this border this border comes from also spellbinders and this is spellbinders and Parisian accents and he comes with this really large border here and he can emboss it. I chose, I actually did not emboss it. I just die cut it out. And then I'm gonna be threading some ribbon through it to give it more of a, an impactful if, effect, if you will. So I'm gonna go ahead and start putting everything together. Like I've said, I've already cut this out and pierced, put a bread through here. This one's actually from American Crafts. Um, 
So, and I use, for this, I use three of the doily. So I use this doily here and this doily here, the outer part to cut the, the circle out, and then for the pink part, I just use this one here. And for this doily, I use this, these two here. So I'm going to go ahead and start putting it all together, and when we get back, we'll see the finished product. So here you have it. This is the card, the finished card. Um, I ended up, I, for, I did forget to tell you that I um, went over with some white pigment ink um, over the embossed part just to bring it to life a little bit more and to you know, give it a little bit more contrast. Um, and then I... Um, I place this second part of the doily um, on a foam uh, square using some foam tape to raise it up also. And then finally I just use some of that same plain uh, ivory ribbon to create um, a cute little bow and um, secure it with a glue dot. So here you have it. Please join me for the second video. Um, not quite sure if they're going to come out together yet, but definitely be on the lookout. You can um, have an easier time of knowing when the videos are coming out if you follow me at my blog um, or subscribe to it if you would like to receive all the posts directly to your email. And also, if you follow me on YouTube, you'll probably be able to uh, know when everything's coming out. Uh, so like I said, some really exciting news, some very cute and very... Um, very nice quality products from uh, the Stamp Doctor so also please feel free to um, and make sure that you check them out and um, thank you thank you so much for joining me and I will see you guys later <laughs>